here with Shea Fields, uh, St. John Bosco receiver. How are you doing, Shay? I'm good. How are you? Great. So you've had a, a good week of practice out here. Um, they, they look like it's uh, it looks like it's real competitive out there. A lot of DBs pressing hard in coverage. Coaches staying on your your backs, making sure you guys know the plays and and run the routes right. Can you talk a little bit about your experience here so far this week? Uh, my experience has been great. Just getting to know other guys from the East and also from my team from the West that I haven't actually met before. It's just it's a great good job actually for me just trying to communicate with them and get to know them a little bit better. Have you been able to see little ways that you've been able to, to raise your game this week? Yeah, I mean, I've seen some things I needed to work on and tried to work on a little bit in one-on-ones and team and just getting ready for college. So you're in a unique position. You you uh, committed to USC, but they've had a coaching change, and a lot of times that means the players or staffs go in a different direction, so you're in the evaluation process right now. One of the teams that's been in on you lately is, is Cal. Can you talk a little bit about your communication with them so far this last month or so? Uh, probably in this last month it's been kind of Coach Likens and Sonny Dykes have been calling me and just basically saying we're trying to get you up here for a visit and then see where you go from there. Can you talk a little bit about their wide receiver coach, Coach Likens, what your relationship was like with him? Uh, me and him, we actually, we actually talk a lot. He's a good guy. I mean, I asked Bryce uh, a little bit about him. He said he's a good coach, real good coach. He works on technique a lot and, and me and him have just been talking. So, um, Bryce, I guess, is your cousin? Yes. Okay, so that would make uh, like make um, his dad, his dad Brian. Is uh, yeah, Brian is my mom's brother. Okay, got it. So, uh, you work with Brian, and yes. uh, he's, he's a former Cal great. Yeah, I know uh, he's not the kind of guy... St. John Bosco receiver coach, actually. Yeah, yeah. Um, so, I, I know he's not the type of guy that pushes his program real hard, but I know he has a lot of love for it. Can you talk about what his approach has been with you about... Um, um, you know, given whatever advice he has about Cal? Uh, the first thing he's been saying is, I mean, the education is great. You can't go wrong with a Cal degree. You can go anywhere with it. But he's, he's been basically just pushing education first. So Brian and, and Bryce are two guys that really emphasize technique quite a bit. Has that rubbed off working with guys like that in, in your game, or do you have a different type of a game? Um, I'm, I'm kind of similar to what he's teaching. I just kind of rely on my speed more, but also use technique as well. Okay. So watching you out on the field, you, you have a lot of fun. You, you got sort of a sort of a humorous, cocky streak to you. You remind me a little bit about a former Cal receiver, Deshaun Jackson. <laughs> um, is that kind of the way you see it? Is confidence something that gives you a little edge in your game? Uh, yeah, I mean, yeah, it does. I mean, most of the time I just don't get rowdy by anybody. I mean, I just just basically play within myself and I know what I can do, so I'm kind of kind of confident. So there's another uh, Cal commit that's out there practicing with you every day, Eric Brown. What's he been talking about? Uh, he's, he's been saying, come be my roommate. We can be teammates. We can be all Americans as freshmen. Just, uh, just the same old, the same old push that anybody would do. Yeah, what's uh, what's his game like compared to yours? How do you how do you compare yourself to each other? Um, I mean, we're kind of similar. He's just taller, but he's probably a little bit more physical than I am. But we, we have kind of almost the same attributes. So another program that's in the mix with you is Colorado, and you're going to be taking an official visit out there. Have you visited unofficially yet? No, I have not. Okay, so what are you looking for on a trip out there? Uh, to see the facilities and look forward to talking to the head coach and the receiver. Coach and kind of chopping up the depth chart if I do decide to go there. Is that visit on the 17th? Yes. Okay, so the Cal visit is on the 24th. Yes. And uh, Eric will be up for that? Uh, no, he already took his. Yeah, he did. Do you know anybody else that's coming up there that weekend? Uh, probably Chandler Lanou and probably some other people. And uh, are you fairly close with Chandler being teammates? Yeah, or? me and him, me and him are actually cool friends. We hang out at school and outside of school. Have you talked about the possibility of playing together? Does that factor in at all? I, I mean, a little bit. Me, me and him talk at school. Basically, just say, uh, let's go. We could probably be teammates for college also. Yeah. yeah. So um, what role does academics play for you in the, the decision process? Uh, I mean, just in case football doesn't work out, I don't go to the NFL. Probably just, I mean, with my degree, whichever school I decide to go to, I'll probably take steps from there. Any idea what your GPA is right now? Uh, 3.0 3. Q. Great. And uh, are you looking at any particular area of study? Uh, I'll probably major in communications or sports medicine. Right. Any predictions for the game tomorrow? Uh, the West is going to win. All right. Good luck. Thank you.